Chile, chile. Wow, you see? That's Indian hospitality from Sammy and his cousin. <laughs> Thank you so much, guys. So the, the, it's very interesting because this is Kawa, so it's pretty much, uh, what is it, green, green tea? No, not green tea. Uh, yeah, a little, little bit like green tea. And inside, as you can see, they put some, they, they crushed some almonds from apricot, apricot almonds. Thanks a lot, guys. Really appreciate it. Before riding, it's gonna, it's gonna be very good. Wow, it's excellent. Wow, it's very good, guys. Amazing, loving it. Kilometers, baby. Couple of push-ups. <laughs> oh, celebrating push-ups. <sighs> Thanks for the support, guys. Thirty thousand kilometers, and it's only the beginning. Yeah. Chale, chale. <laughs> so let's get a little closer. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What a view, guys. What a view. Lovely. This is right next to the war memorial. We're gonna stop here very, very quickly. Saliha wants to take a picture because she spotted something funny. Uh, Mom, I'm lost. You see that stuff here? Yeah. Mom, I'm lost. Are you finally gonna tell your mom? Yes. <laughs> Morning guys, um, live from Diskit in Nubra Valley this morning uh, and with uh, Saliha, my uh, rider partner in crime, we are going, look at this beautiful place by the way, this is where we've been uh, staying last night, very green with a nice view on the mountains, a lot of flowers, I really, I really like this place and we actually had a good deal, it was uh, 1600 for the night including dinner and breakfast, so now we are heading to uh, Diskit town and there is a, a really beautiful monastery it seems and a massive Buddha stupa so we're gonna go and check that out let's go okay now now downtown in Diskit guys and we can see mama donkey and little donkey smashing together happily uh, six box of whatever booze it was <laughs> that's so cool only in India um, guys, we didn't make it to the Gompa because I have a massive puncture. So I had to uh, find a mechanic. Unfortunately, there's only one here and it's closed today. There was a phone number and uh, someone rang the mechanic for us. And uh, now hopefully he's going to be coming soon to, to, to bail me out because, wow, um, it could be worse to be honest. I could be like literally in the middle of nowhere. And because I'm very, very dumb, I didn't buy another. I used my last uh, uh, puncture kit. I think yeah, back, back in Islamabad, I think in Pakistan, and, and ever since I forgot to, to buy a new one. Thank God it's a tubeless tire, so you can easily fix it. I hope so. I haven't really looked on the tire to see how bad the puncture is. I don't think it's too bad. Our bikes are here, Salia's bike is here, and, and my bike is here, and yeah, as you can see, it's completely flat. So it should be okay though. So let's see, let's wait for the mechanic. Let's wait for the bike doctor and see what he says. 
Uh, I did. I couldn't see the phone number. Hey, bro. Nice ride, eh? Wow, that's very, very nice ride, man. Yeah. Very right. clean. Bro, do you know? Are you from here? Do you know uh, someone that can help me with my uh, puncture? Come. You see my uh, tire is puncture? Uh, yeah. yeah. Do, do you know where I could find someone to help me? This way. Very nice hat, by the way. <laughs> it's not going to protect him much if he falls, but it uh, looks, looks cool. Where are you from, bro? I'm from France, bro. France. Mais France, c'est bon. Mais France, c'est bon, c'est bon. France, c'est bon. Yeah, bro. Ducati, Ducati. Yeah, Ducati Scrambler. No problem, bro. But I can't speak Hindi. Uh, this mechanic cannot help. No, no problem. Okay. Okay, bro. I will. I will find another place. Five kilometers. Five Honda. Honda. Yeah. Honda is the next village. Yeah, next village down. Maybe they could help. Me. But uh, so uh, the thing is, it's five kilometers. It's a bit too far. I don't know. I can't. I can't ride the bike for five kilometers. I'll have to find, I'll have to work something out. Let's see. I will call my friend. You have a friend you can call? Yes, he's from here. Oh yeah, thank you so much, brother. I appreciate it. So very, very nice local. They're helping me. They are just going to pump the tire for me to go to uh, the next town. It's actually not even the next town. It's a couple of uh, towns uh, down this way. It's 10, 12 kilometers. And there apparently there's a pump chair repair shop, but in the meantime for me to go, they will just pump the tire because luckily it's tubeless. Start on exit. Okay. Yes. Wow. Is it what? <laughs> Is it only a small thing or just We'll see, we'll see. But the, the only shop open is 12 kilometers this way. So they're pumping for, for me to go. For what? To a ponter shop. To repair it. Ponter shop. So thank you so much. Eh? Very, very nice of you. So yeah, they pumped it back to 35 PSI. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you, bye. Okay, yeah, me and, me and uh, Miss Saliha made it to the local repair shop, which was uh, next to the main road. So hopefully we'll be able to, to help me. The good news is uh, the tire is actually uh, holding up well, so it, it must be a very, uh, a very slow uh, puncture because I was, I've been able to ride 15 kilometers without any uh, funny feelings, so it's not that bad. But still, obviously, need to be fixed, especially in this area where there is a lot of uh, off-road and, and all. Let's see, let's find the puncture. Yeah, we found it. Found it. Okay, let's fix that. <laughs> oh yeah, it's quite big. <laughs> At least she's happy. <laughs> Salia is having fun. I'm actually filming because uh, I need to do it myself next time, you know. It's only the, the fourth time, 30,000 kilometers since I left France that I, that I punctured. Three times in Turkey, <laughs> once in Pakistan and, and once here now in India. Uh, so I'll see if I can actually uh, buy, buy a repair kit from the man and then I can just watch the video and do it myself because I know it's not it's really not complicated now it's checking to see if there is any leak okay. <laughs> with a haircut like this you can't go wrong <laughs> um, 30, 35 36 okay no problem Kit nearby? Huh? Okay. Exo. I'll give him a little more. Thank you so much. Keep, keep. Keep. No problem. Keep, okay? Thank you, bye. Thank you for your help. Good luck, eh? Take care. Yeah, you see 100 is so cheap, guys. It's a little bit more than one dollar. So I'll give him a little extra. Uh, okay, perfect. That was nice and quick, bro. You did a great job, bye. Okay. Wait, can I have to Jammu from Jammu city, Jammu city. Okay, beautiful. Okay, awesome. Take care, my man. Bye. Let's go, Sally. Yeah, okay. Ciao, ciao, guys. Uh, Saliha needs to have a chat with uh, a new friend.
You can come on, don't be scared. Give him a hug. Saliha in deep conversation with a, a new friend. So as you can see, guys, we made it to a. Okay, you come. Oh, this one is bigger. Wow. Look at it. It's got a huge bomb. I don't know if you call them bombs. Bombs? Bombs. You know the two bombs? It's like, you know. Yeah. I'm really scared of that. Oh, this one has a piercing in his nose. <laughs> ah. Why? I don't know. So, yeah, guys, as you can see, we made it to uh, some uh, camel trekking area with beautiful sand dunes. We can see people there camel trekking. Um, yeah, very, very touristic area, as you can see, but it, it's. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Salia, you want to check it with you on a motorbike? This, one, this small one is the kid of that last one. Yeah, probably. He keeps on following it, yeah. I don't know how much... Excuse me. Hello, sir. How are you? Do you know how much it is for, for a ride? Yeah. 350. 250 yeah. per person. For 15 minutes. For 15 minutes. Yeah. Okay. And for half an hour, it is 500. Rupees. 500 for half an hour. Ah, but 15 minutes is enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think yeah. 15 minutes is enough. Yeah. 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 After that, they run out of fuel. <laughs> Where are you from, sir? Kahanseho. Ahmedabad. Adabad. Ahmedabad. Ahmedabad. Yeah. What state is it? Gujarat. Gujarat, okay. Yeah. Nice. What road are you? Where are you from? France. France? Yeah. You came here with your family to enjoy the yeah, sentence? Oh, your wife is here. Yeah. Hello, madam. How are you? I'm fine. That's good. Did you, did you go on a ride? Yeah. 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 You did, yeah? Uh, yeah did you enjoy it? Uh, yeah. yeah? <laughs> Why not? <laughs> That's cool. And you said, did you do it? Yeah. yeah. You did as well? Okay. Yeah. Together. Okay. Enjoy the rest of your day. Okay. Bye bye. Yeah, a little romantic ride, guys. Couple ride. Oh, look at the small ones. <laughs> Hey! Hey! <laughs> oh, so cute! Oh! Hey, they're so fluffy, they're so soft, eh? Wow! Oh, buddy! Didn't really like the way they, they beat yeah, them. Yeah, it's exactly, exactly the thing that. But uh, yeah, I suppose maybe they have to as well. I don't know. I just you know actually when I was coming here, I was thinking about it that we are being supporting to sportive, yeah. This for these, you know, they you don't know. Oh yeah. Acting good or not? So yeah, well. yeah, let's come and see. But like, I don't, I don't know. It's very, very. Yeah. Red line. Do, do you feel like yeah I know what you mean? Do you feel like it's a little bit like the elephants in uh, exactly in Thailand? In Thailand. Well, but actually Thailand is way worse than that because I don't think they drug them up. In Thailand, some places they just drug up the the elephants, make them do what what they need to, and it's a bit sad. You can see the elephant is clearly like you know high. The you know tourists are just you know gathering around, just take selfies with them, and they, they, yeah they're really mistreated. Uh, I don't think it's the case here. They they look pretty happy. Actually, that guy. I don't know if it's uh, if this this guy is uh, looking after this camel, but he was loving. Patting. Yeah, yeah. He was showing a lot of loves. Yeah, absolutely. But the I other one. Is. But the other yeah. one was. Yeah, there's always one guy with a stick, right? <laughs> well, look. Even even the police here in India has a stick for non-compliant motorcycles. Yeah, <laughs> so it's for p p people. Yeah. Hey. That's a funny noise. Oh. Wow, what a view, eh? What a view. With my girl and my new friend. <laughs> As, oh, 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 it's funny the way they sit. Yeah, so uh, to be honest, another thing, guys, I didn't expect at all in India, you know, desert, like sand dunes. I don't know if, if you are watching from outside India, if you think about India, would you, would you think about sand dunes and, and camels trekking and stuff like that? Um, so it's pretty cool. Another, another thing I didn't expect, another cool thing about India. Okay? Yes. So who's gonna hit the target? Who's gonna smash the target? Maybe you would be the target. <laughs> <laughs> So this or this? <laughs>
<laughs> we cut this, we cut this, we edit it out. Or down, okay? Like this? This or this? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, just a minute, just a minute. <laughs> don't you don't want to kill him? Uh, he's too young, he's too young to too die. Young to die yeah. oh, oh. Why? Strong, strong, much stronger. Let's go. Yeah, he was in the blue. Come on, show them. Let's go. Ah. <laughs> okay, brother. Thank you, Stenzin. <laughs> Cheers, mate. Okay, so Let me we tell you something. We learned one thing. We both shit. No, no, no. At I'm, normally, I'm not shit. I didn't tell you because uh, I didn't tell also, you. Also, someone, someone is a professional there. Not professional, but I'm, I'm good normally. But this no. is uh, doing it properly. But I tried excuses. before, and I was good. excuses. Excuses. What the? These are shit. The, I was gonna say that. <laughs> oh, bad material. What was an excuse, the Turkish? Now that was fun. It's good, thank you. That was fun. Uh, okay, so uh, let's go to the monastery now. Yeah. Hello! Hello. Jule, Jule. Jule. Hey, how are you? Fine. Uh, how much is it? Uh, 30 each. 30 each? Yeah. Okay. I'm an Ankit from Rajasthan. And, uh, yeah, bro. Very, very happy to, to meet you. So he's from, he said, not far from Jaipur. And he's traveling with his mate. How are you, brother? Hello. Nice to meet you. Up can I have Ranjit Singh. Ranjit Singh. Ranjit Singh. Yeah. Yes. Oh, Singh. Singh is a. Singh is like Singh Raj. Rajputana. Okay, Raja. so Singh is also in not only in Punjab, also Rajasthan. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Everywhere in India? All over India? Especially uh, Singh is uh, established from Rajasthan, especially. Especially like, from Rajasthan? Because, because, ah. because oh, Rajputana, ah, We learn every Rajputana, day, guys. You know the name of Rajasthan. Rajasthan means Rajas, Rajas state. Okay. okay. And Rajas state means all over the Rajputs. Okay. Rajputs are there. Okay. And so, so that's the four, uh, the four lads. Friends, right? The four lads. Three, or, and three of them nice. from Bikaner. Have you heard about that? No, no, I haven't. I haven't been to your state yet. I will. You must. And whenever you came, Jaipur especially, just visit me. I will. Sure. So, uh, cool guys. How did you come here? Driving? Drive. Bike. Driving all the way? Yeah. Personally car. B b car, okay. Car. 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 Wow, that's cool. It's no way. Like two, two one, two thousand kilometers. Yeah, we are oh, almost about two thousand. We have covered almost two thousand kilometers. Wow, that's awesome, man! Rajasthan, Congratulations, Rajasthan. Well done, lads. Great it's performance. First, first time for me, and it's a milestone for me as well. Of course. If you can drive here, you can drive anywhere. That's true. <laughs> that's true. So, did you guys feel anything with the height? Did you struggle yeah, a bit? Yeah, we feel. Yes. Uh, Gipsa, have you visited Gipsa? Yeah. Fourteen thousand Manali. feet. Manali, yeah. Yeah, Manali to Lake. Gispa, you were Gispa, you were yeah. struggling, yeah. Eh? Spa. Yeah, you felt like some headache or yeah, no? Headache. We, we can't yeah? even. You as well, yeah. We yeah. can't even sleep there. Yeah. Really? <laughs> we we can't even. Bro, sleep I, I, four, I, just, I just smoked cha and I was fine, bro. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm gonna enjoy the view. Pleasure to meet yeah. you. Yeah. Oh, guys, look at that view. This is unreal. So, of course, the beautiful 105 feet Buddha, which is. Not your usual Buddha, like the one you would have uh, next to your bathtub. Uh, but that view, guys, insane. Yeah, you know, that's something I noticed, like uh, monks, um, they, they really like set themselves up, up properly. Eh? All the monasteries I've been to, you know, look at that. Isn't it the perfect view to, uh, to meditate, pray, and, uh, and question life, pretty much? Uh, oh man, this this is lovely. Maybe I should become a monk. For now, I'm more I'm more a monkey. For now, I'm more Frenchy monkey than a monk. It'll be interesting to do some kind of uh, meditation or something to see how it actually works. To see if I could actually cope with it. I met a girl from uh, Russia in Le. She was telling me she went on this meditation camp for ten days. Couldn't speak. Uh, obviously, no phone. Couldn't write. Man, and she said only one person left. I would have gone crazy. I don't know if I could do it. 
But anyway, that's it. That's it for the beautiful view and the beautiful um, Buddha. The Gompa right here. So this was Diskit Gompa, guys. Now we're gonna go down, pack up, and uh, and start riding again. So li leaving the beautiful and green uh, guest house. The name is Eco Eco Garden. Eco Tel. Eco Tel. Eco Tel. Eco Tel. It's uh, you continue in the market in this kit. It's very good value, very good service. The host, Pamlo, is lovely, <laughs> lovely host. Thank you. That's your uh, family? Uh, grandmother. Your grandmother? Yeah. Oh, wow, your grandmother. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, great service. Thank you, brother. Yeah. Great stuff as well. So, all the best, eh? Yeah. Thank you so much. You. Thank Take you. care. Bye-bye. Bye. Diane Rakna. Okay guys, um, so that's it for us, for Nubra Valley. I might show you some, some stuff on the way back if you want to stick around for a couple of minutes and there will be some awesome landscape. So stick around for a couple of minutes. Let's ride and I'll see you in the next video. Firmelinge!